Hello YouTube. On today's episode, I'll be doing a what's in my bag slash review on the Louis Vuitton Speedy Bandelier 35 in the Demir Abin color. This was a Christmas gift and before I decided on which bag I wanted, I did watch a lot of videos and did a lot of research because this is my first Louis bag and I wanted it to be perfect and I finally had narrowed it down to this particular bag and hopefully this video can help others who are deciding to make a Louis bag purchase and can't decide. Okay, so the box comes in this pretty color bag, which I will, will probably keep because I'm extra like that. And this is the box it comes in. By the way, I did take the bag out of the box and I'm just kind of showing you the packaging. Um, I have a picture of the way it looks, how it comes inside the box and it is folded pretty, but it makes the bag have creases and I'm trying to get rid of the creases so I took it out already. So inside the box, uh, well, it's covered with this ribbon and this little gift tag where you can, you know, write a cute little note, which I did not receive, but it's okay. The bag was more important. And it has a desk cover. And also it has your proof of purchase in this nice little folded envelope and I guess you know just in case you wanted to resell and but it's nice to keep it as as a record I'm probably not gonna sell it anyway but it's nice to have okay this is the beautiful bag which I absolutely love I love everything about it you can see the creases there but I did buy some bag accessories which will help with that and I will sh be showing you that later but I love it and I guess I should tell you my reasons behind deciding to make this my first Louis bag. Well, I like the shape. It's a classic. I like the color. I decided to have this color because it kind of goes with everything in this bag. It can be dressed up. It can be dressed down. So it's very versatile. And it also can be worn in different ways because it's the bandolier so it comes with the strap which you can also adjust you can have it as a crossbody and as a shoulder bag which I love and I love the double zippers here on the side well on the top and the red print inside I think it's so cute okay and inside well it comes well here's the strap that it comes with and you can like I said adjust the strap to however you want it well okay I won't be doing it now but yeah it's pretty and also it has well I didn't put it on yet because I've been wanting to make this video but here's the little baggie with the key and the lock I guess I can open that up now so excited I was so excited when I got this guys okay here comes here's a box ah, it's like Christmas all over again is the set of keys I don't think I will be locking my bag because hopefully I can trust the people I'm around but it is cute but my bag is looking a little naked so I will be putting it on for decoration here's the lock it's so cute and they say to put it on which side on the side with the letters facing down or where you can read it on the left hand side of the bag so I'll be putting this on also I do plan on purchasing a luggage tag to add to the bag and I am going to get it hot stamped um, which is free by the way um, I wasn't able to get have it done now because it's holiday season and they weren't providing that service tier tier but I will be doing it as soon as I can 
Okay, my bag doesn't look naked anymore. I just put the lock on right here and I'm going to, well for now I'm gonna keep the keys in the pocket inside. Oh yeah, it does have a pocket with a zipper, which is good by the way. I like that feature, it's nice. And I put the strap on. Also, I love the fact that this bag has a reinforced leather band going down the sides. I like that. Some people do like their bag to be saggy, but I don't find that too appealing. I kind of like my bag to be structured, so I did buy some items to help with that. Um, I bought both of these items off of Amazon. This is a base shaper and it just goes in the bottom of the bag and keeps it, helps keep it structured. I'll be providing the links of the items in the description box. Um, I got this for $19.99 off of Amazon and it says reduce sagging and protect your handbag. And this one was specifically for this bag style and size. And I also purchased a bag organizer here. Also has a zipper on the side and another, some a lot of pockets and pockets here. This is also specifically for this bag and this was by Layla Lux. I also purchased this off Amazon and it was, how much was it, $41.90. Okay, 14 pockets and two sizes. This is the extra large for this bag. And it also helps keep it structured and keeps it clean. I'm trying to preserve this bag as, you know, as much as I can. So this is definitely going to be a big help and help keep me organized. The bag itself just looks and feels so much better with the base shaper and the and the organizer inside. It's just, I like it more structured. It's just my preference, everyone's different, but those are the items I purchased to help with that problem. This is what the inside of the bag looks like with the organizer inside. As you can see, it does fit perfectly. Um, I forgot to mention that on, well, on the other side, there is a little key holder here. You can put your keys. And I just, I just love the color. I love the red inside. Like I said before, this is the size 35 bag. I knew that I wanted my bag to be on the bigger side because I am not a little girl. I am 5'9", and I think this size fits perfectly with my body and height. I'm seven months pregnant, by the way, so keep that in mind. But I'll be showing you guys pictures of what it looks like on my full body so you can get a better, a better view. But I think it's perfect. Okay, now for the what's in my bag portion of this video. So I did take out the organizer because it's just easier to show you guys this way. This is what it looks like full. It is kind of heavy. Got a lot of junk, well stuff. Okay guys, so let's show you what's in my bag. <laughs> so I guess it'll be easier to go left to right, I guess. Okay, so in this pocket here, we have a phone charger, which I never go without. I have to stay connected, okay? So my charger, and in that pocket as well, are my Bluetooth headphones, which I also like to go everywhere with. We have some pens, keep two just in case. Um, I have, well, let's kind of go in category, I guess. So this is my journal. I like to carry this around with me as well so I can write down my thoughts and ideas. As you can see, it's gold. I like shiny stuff, so it's shiny, glittery. Um, I have some lotion, stay hydrated 
or not hydrated, moisturized. <laughs> I have some hair ties. You never know when you may need them. I'm a hairstylist, so I like to carry hair stuff with me. I have a deck of cards. You never know when you're going to be bored and may, and may need to save a party or something, the life of the party. Some mascara. I have, oh yeah. This is my selfie ring light, which I got off of Amazon. And you just clip it to your phone. You can take selfies or put it the other way. I carry this with me to not only for selfies because, well, I am a cosmetologist and I do hair. So when I take pictures or videos of my work, I like to use it. This is it. I think it needs to be charged, but it's cool. This is a notepad that I just got opens up like this for my brilliant ideas guys I have this this is also which is also gold and glittery a little pouch I guess you can put whatever you want in it coins or whatever but I just have some lip glosses this is Lancome juicy tubes which I'm currently using and I do like by the way and just some Eo, how do, I don't know how to pronounce that word. Eos, Eek, Eos, whatever. But it's the same brand as of lotion that I have. I like my lips to be moisturized and my skin to be moisturized as well. I have some edge control. Like I said, I am a hairstylist. And along with that, an edge control double-sided brush and comb, guys. I have my wristlet. No, big bucks and who I would speak into existence, y'all. Speak into existence. I have a bottle of perfume. This is YSL Black Opium, which is almost finished, by the way. A lighter that I got from Jamaica, just in case, you never know. I'm not smoking or nothing, but I don't know, just in case. I have, well, this was on the little keychain holder thing in my bag, but this is some hand sanitizer. It says, choose happy on the back. 2018, we're choosing to be happy. I got, well, these are some keys. I do need a new key, probably whatever lanyard but yeah this is my keys with my um gym membership and other memberships cosmoprof i'm cosmetologist i keep saying that i'm so happy to be a cosmetologist guys um and a what is this called Mem oh god i can't but the thing where you a memory drive yes keep those handy just in case and other things um, I have some body butter. Like I said, stay moisturized. A comb. Because, guess what? Yes, I'm a hairstylist. If I didn't mention it, just in case. Let me... Okay, we good. I have some pepper spray. Thank God I never had to use it yet. But you can never be too safe, guys. And it's pink. I, well, my favorite color is pink, if you didn't know that or couldn't tell. But yes, I love pink. And I got it from Target. It was cheap, probably, I don't know, $9.99 or something like that in that range. But yeah, I got it, especially since I got, well, I got, well became pregnant. I have to stay safe. I have a lock well i just like to keep it at least in one place where i know where it's at this is for when i go to the gym and i you know use the locker but i keep my lock with me never and you never know you may need to put it in the sock no i don't promote violence i have 
these are this is blotting paper for your when your face gets oily and you know you have your makeup just and you don't want it to ruin your makeup you just blot and it just takes the oil away i have some water stay hydrated some gum I love these. I always get the same kind though. The uh, Mentos Pure Fresh gum. These are the best kind, by the way. I have some, well, this is Liquid Trace Minerals because you know that through, you know, the process when they make your food, they do deplete it of its natural minerals. So this is just to add it back into, if you could put it in your, um, drinks like water or whatever it has a we're you know just a few drops but it does well it's okay we'll just try it um i have this was this is the foundation that i'm using now but this is just it in a little sample thing just in case from the go a compact mirror it says young and free and what else well i have my passport because i lost my license and eh, long story is a long story but yes travel far travel often and it's pink of course what else i think that's it for now yeah that's it and that is what's in my bag. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for updates on my future videos, guys. And have a lovely day. Goodbye.